How to update your SYNC 3 navigation software via USB. To start, you will need a USB drive with at least 16 gigabytes of storage formatted to EXFAT. Your computer will need at least 20 gigabytes of hard drive storage to download the files. First visit the Ford SYNC Navigation Updates website as seen on the screen or in the description below. Enter your VIN into the box to check for updates. After clicking Check Available Updates, the website will show any available navigation updates for your vehicle. Depending on the age of the vehicle, the updates may have to be paid for to be downloaded or through shipping. If your vehicle qualifies for a complimentary update, it will be available to download for free and a cost of $40 for the USB through shipping. These updates require the vehicle to be updated to one of the later versions of SYNC 3. You can find out how to do this in the card in the corner of the screen. After you've gone through the checkout process, you can download the instructions, map file, and license file. Click download for both the map file and license file. These updates are fairly large, so it may take a while depending on your internet connection and speeds. Find the file from your downloads folder and copy the three files it contains onto your USB drive. Then find the license file in your downloads and copy it into the SYNC My Ride folder. Now you can eject the USB drive from your computer and head to the vehicle. Start the vehicle and be sure other USB ports within the vehicle don't have anything plugged into them. Find the front ports in the vehicle and plug the USB drive with the update into it. After the USB is plugged in, it should show system updating at the top. It will then prompt you to start the update and what systems may be unavailable during the update. If the update is aborted, those features may not function until it is successfully completed. The update will take a very long time, so please keep your vehicle running during this process. The process should take between one and one and a half hours to complete. The system may restart a couple times, but do not remove the USB until it says it is complete. Hopefully you have successfully installed the latest navigation software on your SYNC 3 system. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button. If you are new to the channel, consider checking out some of the other content and subscribing to the channel. And if you have any questions, comments, or anything regarding this video or the channel, leave all those down in the comment section below. And as always, we'll see you guys in the next one.